So how should brands, how can they approach Pride Month? With me, Mick Mulvaney, former acting White House Chief of Staff for President Trump and News Nation political contributor. Mike Sachs, legal analyst who has worked for Huffington Post, Fox 5, and Nomiki Konst, a former Bernie Sanders surrogate and organizer. Um, did, I get you, did I pronounce it correctly? Yeah, okay. yeah. Uh, you just gave me a look, like, like maybe I got it <laughs> No, I was... Again. It's like you've got one of those names where you can get both the first name and the last oh, it's, name it's wrong fun. in terms of the pronunciation. <laughs> um, all right, Namiki, what do you think, I mean, if, if, a, if a sort of brand came to you mm -hmm. and they said, we got to figure this out, we know we're going to get hit, how much do we have to do to keep the LGBTQ community with us, et cetera, what do you tell them? Say stand by your values. Stand by what, you know, don't be afraid of the conservative outrage base that, you know, maybe short term your numbers will go down. But long term, you're losing a broader audience. I mean, since the, the Republicans, the right wing has gone after some of these brands, you've also seen those on the left saying, you know what, we never we should have never supported them to begin with because Target was giving money to X, Y, Z different causes that we don't believe in. And Bud Light was doing X, Y, Z. And so it's having the same effect on both sides. So I would love to see the numbers right now to see how many people have fallen off from the left as well as the right. But, you know, usually this game is played by the left and they hold true because they care about where their money goes in terms of, of what it represents in the community. Usually the right doesn't do that and it doesn't last. I, you're disagreeing with me, uh, but you know, I just, I just you know, don't I, think I, it's I'm a- I'm a lot more agnostic about this one. I, I, would tell, I, I would give them different advice, which is if you're gonna play politics, okay, you better be good at it. You better be as good at politics as you are at selling beer or you know selling clothes or whatever. Because if you're not as good as you are in what you do, you're going to get killed. But is it, it playing politics is to have a trans to, you know person as a corporations for generations have been able to say, you know what, we're in the business of selling this or making this to be able to stay out of politics. They play both sides. They donated to both mm -hmm. sides. They have been agnostic and they didn't get dragged into this, right? And I think they liked that a lot better. But there's no way back once they've already picked a side. Some corporations, I mean, I could, there's plenty of corporations that have played conservative politics for generations, you know, Family Values, the Marlboro Man, let's go on and on, a list of different Well, now you know, you've got companies there. like Chick-fil-A and some of the others who've been typically associated with more conservative causes. Now people are reading through their policies and, you know, in, in terms of, you know, what they do with regard to bathrooms and this and that, yeah. and that's, you know, then if, they're getting in trouble. If for you're going to play the game, you better be good at it or else you're going to lose. And yeah. a lot of them are losing right now. But they're still only losing a small percentage for a short period of time. Let me tell you, people I'd are like going to go back into. I know people on the left who go to Chick Fil A, even though they don't, they don't really believe in it. It's yeah. short lived. So stand by your brand, stand by your values. If you're going to do this performative stuff, then do it. But if you're not going to do it, if you're going to be wishy washy, then don't do it. But we all know it's performative. And for the bottom line, yes, they've, they've made I just a calculation want to go on record that saying that I'm not related to Dylan Mulvaney, which really sort of yeah, disappointed yeah, me because yeah, I was yeah. interested to know if, if we had been related, but whose reputation would suffer more? Yeah, this is true. Mine this is for true. being related to her or hers right, being related right. to me. We should do a podcast I, together. I think, it's, yeah. the, I think yeah. it's the latter. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you for watching. Go to NewsNationNow.com to find News Nation on your cable provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of News Nation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.